Boop, boop, boop. Another day, another dollar. Thank the Lord for another 24. God, I knew that was you. Just finishing up with a nice little arm workout, man. We swelled them up today, man. Annihilation. Total annihilation on arm. I think I was in there for about, down there about an hour and a half, two hours. Hit nothing but arms, man. Busting them down, man. You feel me? Crazy pump, man. I'm feeling amazing. Feeling energetic, man. You know I'm in a great fucking mood, man. Just got me some Pizza Hut, man. Post-workout meal. You know you gotta eat big and lift big to get big. Ain't no no uh no questions about it, baby. You trying to get size and mass. Me, I'm bulking it definitely, man. I'm I'd rather have the size, the mass over the abs. I can still see my abs a little bit, you know, they just not as more defined as when I was 205. I'm like 240 now, but shit, I still got the results, man. So I ain't tripping, man. People, when I'm out in public, people still come up to me. You know, they they, they say stuff like, how long you been working out, man? Uh, uh, how long did it take you to get that big? You know, people staring at me, you know, when I'm in the gym or out, you know, they see the results, man. So shit, I'm good with it. You know, if you happy for yourself, man, you happy with what your results is, then, by all means, keep doing what you're doing, man. I don't know about nobody else. I know what I'm gonna keep doing, man. I'm gonna keep living, keep lifting, keep eating. I don't, man, just living my best life, man. Taking it one day at a time, man. You know, I'm happy. I'm in a good space, man. My mental health is, is great right now, man. Life is going good. It's only getting better. The topic for today, man, is sometimes in life, you gotta play dumb to get ahead. You got to play like you a mark or you a duck or you just clueless about what's going on around you. You got to play like you just dumb as hell. You know, let people think you dumber than what you are, you know, to get ahead in life, you know. It's just like if you ever watched Dragon Ball Z, right? You remember like towards the beginning of Dragon Ball Z, I think when Vegeta first came to Earth, right? He was, you know, sizing up Goku and whatnot. You know, and he had the scouter on his eye, and you know, he didn't know Goku's true potential. You know, to, I think Goku powered up and whatnot, and Vegeta's scouter went off the wall. It went berserk, man. All my Dragon Ball Z fans that know this part, man, you know, if you don't know, just kind of bear with me. I'm gonna get into the message. But Goku or Vegeta's scouter went berserk. He said, what he say? His power level was 5,000. Or I can't remember the exact number, but he was shocked. He was surprised, like, how strong Goku was, his power level, you know? that's just That relates to what I'm talking about. Sometimes you got to play dumb in the room, man, and let people think they up on you, you know? Even if you might be the strongest, the wisest, the smartest person in the room, the person with the most money, sometimes it's best to play dumb, you know? That way you create less tension. You got less enemies, man. They think you just a duck. They just think you, man, you just a uh, hair for a happy good old jolly time, man. They leave you alone. They don't see you as a threat, you know? Because one thing I learned about in life, man, when you start to get pass people up, man, and start to elevate, man, some of the closest people to you, they start to hate on you. They start to change their stance. They start to act funny around you, man. They show their true colors, you know? They don't like that shit, man. And some people, it's like they want you to do good, but they don't want you to do better than them. So sometimes you just gotta dumb it down, you know? It's nothing wrong with it. You know, when if you know when your head that you the smartest or you know you might be one of the people that got the most money, most successful, man. Ain't sometimes ain't even no need to say nothing. Just just let it be. You know, just just be cool, calm, chill, collected, man. You ain't even got to say nothing, man. If you if you confident in your own skin and you know what you could do, what you're capable of, what you accomplish, you don't even got to say shit, man. You know, that's the best way, man. You create less enemies. It's less bullshit. You ain't got to worry about as many people hating on you, you know? Me, you know, I might I might put on, you know, I might put out some stuff, but I don't put out everything, you know? I don't put out my every move. You know, I might post a lot on social media and whatnot, but I don't post everything, you know? Sometimes you don't know who hating on you. You know who might be family and friend. 
that you that you consider a family or friend, but deep down they hating on you, snaking on you, man, wishing your downfall. You don't know who's who, you know. That's why you don't put everything out, you know. You gotta you gotta leave them you gotta leave them guessing in the dark. You know, they don't know they don't really know how far ahead you are or how much money you got or how much how how much of your goals you can accomplish. You know, they don't know everything. You know, leave them guessing some, man. Don't just give them the rope to hang you with. They already don't like you. They already, man, they hate you. They hate your guts, man. They might not tell you. They might smile in your face, man, and be talking shit about you, hating on you, man, behind your back, man. You know how the game go. That's just how life goes, man, you know. Sometimes I play it down, I play dumb. You know, I, I I might, you know, sometimes you don't even got to play dumb. You could just agree, disagree with what they saying. Keep it short. Mm -hmm. Yeah, okay, yeah, I feel you. Yeah, true. You know, just say something. Keep it short, concise, man. You know, don't get into too deep into your thoughts of how you really feel or what, what you really got going on in your life, man. Because sometimes people... They'll, they'll, they'll pick and probe, asking you questions, man, trying to find out, you know, the, the, the depth of how much you uh, are ahead in life and whatnot, man. You know what I'm saying? They trying to see what you got going on, see what's going on in your life, how you know what, what's over here. You know, they curious, man. You know, people be nosy, man. You know, they be ear and eye hustling, man. You know, you just got to be observant of who you around. Know the room. Know who you dealing with, man. You know, sometimes it's best. The older I get, man, the more I think before I speak. You know, if I know somebody, I might I might, I might, might want to say something, but I withhold it. I, I don't say it when I'm around certain people, when I'm having a conversation, you know. I don't say it, man. I keep it to myself, man. It's power in that, man. It's power in silence, sometimes keeping it in, you know. Don't let people know your every move. You got to play dumb sometimes. Play down to their level, man. You know, let them think they up on you, man. They won't, then they won't perceive you as a threat. They won't perceive you as something like competition, man. You know, trying to knock you off, man. They just think, yeah, whole time, you might be this much ahead of them. You might have this much more money or more. Man, you already got the game figured out, man. You already got your shit figured out, man. They still trying to figure their shit out. You know, it's just family. You can do that shit with family, friends. I don't care who it is, man. Don't give your every move to everybody, man. Hold some shit back, man. Some shit you got to take to the grave with you, man. Just that's how the game goes, man. Play it down sometimes, man. That's for the best, man. I'm telling you. That shit work, man. It's gonna help you out in the long run. You know, you just, you, people, man, you gonna create less traffic, man, less tension, man. You, you got less enemies to worry about when you move that way. You know what I'm saying? Y'all like this video, make sure you subscribe to my channel, at the Ghetto Bodybuilder. Follow me on Instagram, TikTok, at the Ghetto Bodybuilder. I got merchandise for sale. Shop with your boy, www.theghettobodybuilder.com. This one of my t-shirts right here, man, on my website. Stop hating, you know, I try to come up with catchy little slogans, catchy little phrases, you know what I'm saying, man. Just something to keep people motivated, catch people's eyes, man. Play it down, man. Less is more sometimes, man. Keep it in, man. Don't tell them everything, man. Don't give them all the rope to hang you with. They already want to hang you, man. Give them, make it, make them fight for it, man. You feel me, man. You're going to be all right. Y'all know how we coming. Let's get motivated.